I have nothing. I wish I had sanitizer. Here, I'll sanitize. <laughs> right? Start washing your hands, right? Sanitizer? <gasps> Rob! Hey! How you doing, guys? It's Rob and Jan again. Rob and Jan Can Van. Yeah, and here we are in Echo Bay. And we came Echo across... Bay. Ontario. Ontario, of course, uh, and and we're looking for some spare change. If you, if we, you know, we're just looking for yeah. some loose change, and thought we, we uh, uh, might have come across some. We here. found a monument here in Echo Bay that was dedicated. I think we ruined it. Bay, Ontario, and we we're looking for some loose change. I don't know if there's any around that we could find because you know it's always good to buy a Tim Hortons coffee or something with uh, you know some change that you find here and there. So let's see if we can find some. Why are you pushing me? Because I want to see if I can find some. <laughs> anyway, here we are. <laughs> Ta da! At uh, you have to move over a bit more, I think. A monument for the loony. Yep. And it's in Echo Bay, Ontario, yep. on Highway 17B. Yep. And it was dedicated uh, to. Look, I have a loony on my head. Who was it dedicated to, Janet? This is your cue. Oh, Robert R. Carmichael. Did I get that right? Oh, she wins. She wins the Timmys. It was. It was dedicated to the artist. Uh, who designed the loonie, which is Canada's $1 coin. Because in Canada, we have loonies and toonies. We do not have bills less than $5 denominations. So our $1 uh, a bill is not a bill, it's a coin. And our $2 bill is not a bill, it's a coin. So this is our loonie. And it was done in 1987, by the looks of it. Uh, yeah, I believe that's what it yeah. says, eh? Yeah. 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 So. so we'll give you a little tour around. Yeah. And okay, check it out. This is what it's all about. Anyway, we didn't know it was here, and uh, it's kind of cool. So yep. uh, here's the view that we got. up my nose. <laughs> Sanitizer. Here, I'll sanitize. <laughs> right? Start washing your hands, right? Sanitizer? <gasps> Rob! <laughs> Don't! Canada style. Yeehaw! Okay. There we go. Complete with travertine tile. 
All, <laughs> all the basics. I had to pee. I'll deal with it. <laughs> Don't keep putting the camera on me. Okay, let's go. Yeah, you know what? If you wanted to come up here, you could. And then, eh? and then what? And then what? Well, I'm almost back to where we were looking on that edge, eh? Okay. I'll come. Okay, but now listen. What? Where you see the nails running along the boards, that's where you walk. What does that mean? Don't walk in the middle. Walk where the nails go through the boards. Walk on top of the nails because that's where the studs are. Why don't you come back for me then? Well, or if you want, you just walk through and I'll meet you at the other end. I'll, I'll meet you, yeah. I'll go back around the same way we came and I'll meet you at the other end. Okay, then. Meet me on that corner where you get off. Yeah, right. Okay. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. You can film me coming back. Okay, I will. If I, uh, yeah. Bye. If bye. you make it. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, guys, if you can see this, oh, hey, bird. Uh, if you can see this, I'm walking, and I'm having to walk right on where the nails are because I don't trust that any of these boards won't give out from underneath me because they are in bad shape. In fact, I'm surprised that they even have this out here. There should be warnings that people, uh, you know, shouldn't be coming up here, but uh, at any rate, uh, I can see this being a, a really interesting place when the birds are uh, migrating or in the summer when everything's uh, full activity. But uh, boy, she's in bad shape, this, uh, this walkway. And uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't know if they're in the process of redoing it because the one walkway was redone. But uh, as you can see, everything is pretty covered in moss and uh, things of that nature. So anyway, here's a... A display that uh, kind of tells some stuff that goes on here this uh, Christian uh, student uh, his name is Christian Christian anyway okay so this is what we're looking at this is the marsh area so anyway I'll just do a scan of this then I'll head back. Okay. Yeah, they have a couple lookouts here, but uh, I wouldn't uh, risk going up on them. Uh, as you can see, this is what I'm. This is what I'm walking through. Uh, about every ten feet, uh, uh, and you can see the punkiness of the boards here. Uh, I don't know if it was pressure treated. I, I don't think so by the, by the looks of things here because it's just uh, uh, starting to rot out. It's got lots of uh, pilings, but uh, the structure on top of it is uh, becoming uh, rather unstable. So anyway, this is an interesting place. This is almost like the crossroads. You don't know where you're going to go. Well, you know where you're going to go if you step in the wrong place. Okay, Janice waiting for me on the other end here. She says she'll meet me there if I make it. And away we go. Oh. 
Whoa! What do we got here? Well, somebody's done the old walk down the pallet thing here. So, anyway, we'll give this a try. If I make it, I'll be back. Oh, made it. A little sketchy. But, uh, yeah, they just leaned the pallet up against the uh, walkway with a couple of uh, two-by-fours, and uh, away we go. Now, this might be a little wetter, but uh, you know what? It is a marshland. So, anyway, here we go. I was, I was crying out, help me, help me, but where were you? I was going all the way back around to get here. It's a long further, <laughs> long further back, you know, yeah. the shortcut. Yeah, the shortcut. There you go. Yeah, boy. Okay, we're going to play a little game here with Janet. Just showing all this. And now... It's a multi-tool thing for if you need something fixed. What? It's a multi-tool. It's an air pressure gauge? Look at this. Okay, this is pretty cool, guys. I've never seen one of these before. So anyway, yeah, so here you go. You can pump up your tire. You can fix your, do your repairs on your bike down here. As you can see, all the tools are here. It's a, it's a bicycle rack too. It holds the bicycle and locks it in place. Yeah. Because you can use these parts. Well. Yes. Yeah. That's for yeah. A bicycle lock. So you can. Put well, the, the, those, those are for it. taking uh, the no. tire. Th that's for taking the tire off, I eh? I know, but they also have it so you can put it in place and lock yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Cool. Pretty cool. cool. So did you get any of that part there, or did you? No, yeah, so. I did. <laughs> so we're back to the. Heads and back to Ramona. Yep, back to Ramona. So anyway, off we go. And away. 